Welcome to Mount Zion Carnation Ministries, the arena of the supernatural, where supernatural is natural. Our vision is to bring Christ's abundant life, knowledge, and hope to Inanda, then to the whole world, in the form of preaching, teaching, holistic gospel, healing, deliverance, counseling, training, and discipleship. Here we go. At Mount Zion Carnation Ministries, Jesus is Lord. That single belief calls us together as a community and sends us into our world with hope and purpose. At Mount Zion Carnation Ministries, your past will never define your future. There is always redemption, which means there is always a brighter day. At Mount Zion Carnation Ministries, we do not think that we are better than any other church out there. We are just doing our best to become our best. At Mount Zion Carnation Ministries, we want you to believe in God, but also we want you to know that God believes in you. We are not against any people who do not attend church anywhere. Instead, we pursue them with love, the very same love that is pursuing us. At Mount Zion Carnation Ministries, we are committed to serve God and people. We take ownership and account for our decisions, answerable or accountable as for something within one's power. We do what we say we will do. We are learning to serve God with all our hearts and we are learning to worship Him with all our lives. And if you are looking for the perfect church, we are not it. At Mount Zion Carnation Ministries, we will make mistakes, but we will choose to grow from them. At Mount Zion Carnation Ministries, we are part of a global community that is knit together by the resurrection of Jesus. And by the way, at Mount Zion Carnation Ministries, we believe that really happened too. At Mount Zion Carnation Ministries, we will engage with people who are in real need because we are the hands and feet of Christ. And finally, we need you to hear this loud and clear. At Mount Zion Carnation Ministries, it's not our church at all, but it is His and we live and move and breathe in His church for His glory and fame and not for ours. So there's the invitation. You are invited to jump in with your whole heart at your own pace and experience the life that awaits you in Christ. Friends, this is going to be good. Welcome to Mount Zion Carnation Ministries from Dr. Swanem Somi and Tabisilam Somi. Praise the Lord. Because we come with the background. Then I want Pastor Mia to explain to us because she comes from the background. Please, can she come forward? Where's Mrs. Lamini? combination is strong. Mam Goban, hello, so sad and now I'm pumping. Let's start again. I get a cotilla. Shalom from DC. Hello, my husband. Yeah, Pil and Jani. Yeah, Pil and Ami. This is Jan Joba. This is Jan Kuru. I'm calling you. I'm okay, Dad. Tell us, what do you know about this spirit? You know, as a young When I was born, my grandfather was saved. God is in day Ningi. But I saw many things when he died. No good simin and I based near relationship is strong. We had a very good relationship, me and him. Uben Kotela, Upfagas, Lenda Puma, Ugutu Puma Gabi. He would testify about where he came out of. So, no good to guess on Dwayne, Bangan Kazin, Hambana, and guess on Dwayne. And I would go to church with him. Then, Uncle Lugus is this in this or when Zagalan. And then he'd tell me what happens until he got saved. Then, Mrs. Sayas, you would see Umawami. Then you say my mom would trouble him? Because she was born with the spirit of the sorcery. So, 
said, he said that she would slaughter animals until she would have the skins up to their elbows. Each time as a woman to show you some chela story. Because every time she would go to a different person, they'd get, she'd get told a different story. There was never a day that where she went to go and evaluate and everything was fine. So, in Pilo, why in our young Kendo? In life, she had everything. Then, who's Angelo would see why rich Ganaganan? And she would, you tell me how rich she was. Eshonish Ganaganan, Futenda Win. How respected she was in the place. But one day she lost everything. Such that her brother became jealous. And went to go. And then he became a bad ancestor. So my grandfather lost his house. And then poverty entered into our home. Because there's no firmament because now the brothers become a bad uh, ancestor. So wanted to kill him. Then his her brother wanted to kill him. He heard a voice at home. Five when the sorcerer would leave at five, the um, he would speak to me about many things that would happen. How one day Uma Wami Waye Kula Esena four years in a hambi. One day my mom was ill and for four years she couldn't walk. I mean, mengi so four years, I mean, imnyak. Why four years? Yes. Yeah. So, uti, bam, waya lelwa, inyanga, em, esebenza ayo, ngala e chozin. She got sent to a sorcerer in chozin. So, unfortunately, ngele ni ingane ya shon. And on the way that child died. Ngale so skazko kwa ma seventizi, kusawa konu hulumenu wa ubusa ngale so skazi. And that time it was still the apartheid. So Beno Kokwamba Vumelana go gusing go being an issue nil and gonna buy ching Latin. And they agreed that they of would rather... Yes. Was that child your mom? Yes. So Ungobaba Zobosh was get arrested. But travel and is doom. That they're travelling with a dead body. Bengen I permit how to permit. So Uma Bamba si Batoli Kalpo si Bamfage Latin. They found a cardboard, put it in there and threw it in the bush. So Mesebe travel to go kakala kaleg. Then my grandmother started crying. As him years of course like a window then no nya futsi mes buyele kaya, gibuyele kaya minaga shows. And Mesho Bevu Melene Bobabi. Yes. Even though they both agreed, she said she was going to leave him. As who sabama poi sa sang as a stringing and yam. You're so afraid of the police that you would rather throw my child out with the police. And he said that this thing will not get solved. So then they went back and they went to go find the child. And when they got to that bush, the box was still there. But it was still there. Uti is being the Sogusun Koskas and Gimshe move young Kalel and was a good thing for you. I can't say to my wife that I went to the box and found As he was walking a Sunday, and as he was walking closer, yes, Suga and Yoga Pesuke Bogis, the cardboard moved off the box, making any other lala pagas, and inside the child is playing with some tats and a healer from there. And she was healed from she was healed And from there. now the child is not sick, she can walk now. Now the grand will say, you see how wicked you are? So they, start, they kept going to the sorcerer even though the child was healed. And they would get there and it was full. The sorcerer would come and look at all the people outside. And then it would go straight to my, my grandparents and say, Go away from here. No one's going to help you with this child. He, she only has two options. It's either, it's either she becomes a sorcerer. Or she takes the ancestor that is a believer that will allow her to go to church. So my grandfather came back. But then 
my mother was a child who had to stay at home and she got ill no banga le sikhathi mina sengizelwe uma wangithola at the age of 16 years when i was born my mom was 16 years old umkhulu wayethoba yediniwe baba ngendlela isimanga they say my grandfather was so angry wamqosho mayekhaya he chased her out of the house uma nawe engaza fanela phendula thini ngoba bathi mebe mbuzo kuthi wa uyabeletha bathi yini ngathi wingani she didn't even know what to say when he so, chased her out siblings my grandmother at the time she was the one who had the social spirit and so she was the one who sent a letter before my mom was what he put giving questions to my I was told that you must fetch your child as you've chased away because her child has a purpose. Um Kuli had to forgive. So my grandfather had to forgive. Ungoba was a show him Sam Guti, Uma, Gokfane Langzali. Because it was arranged by the ancestors that she must uh, give birth to me when she was 16. So that's how close we were. Because I was the child who was meant to be born. So then my grandfather said he heard a voice calling him one day to go and get saved. So he went to a church. He was saved. So all these years, because was so powerful. Because it was such yeah. that even when the spirit would rise, God, my mom would have to pay. But it was a spirit that was always with him. So umkulu the day ashonangalo. The day that my grandfather died. Wabanoktuga the the few weeks before I shown it. A few weeks before he died. Wakulu kokwami. Ngoba ukshona kwa bogo ashugani so two weeks. Because they died two weeks apart. Ukoko me kula wongu munda figuam criticize. When grand got ill, everyone criticized. What him? Yes, I say as ngoska as as shown a leak or need time, but ungulu ungulu kaga sebens. They will say your your wife will even get sick so, and die with your. So wakunu kula me se vumi le babugu si koko kaga iswe nyangen. So then he allowed for his wife to get sent to the hospital. Wabuya ne miti. She came back with. But still was shown. With the potions, but she still died. So um kulunjalo psugu sas tanda as an eye. So my grandmother and I would pray every night. So Mrs. Tanda Zili Mrs. Sikmina Hambi Yolal. Then you'll say go sleep. Mrs. saying Lele Ganting Ginga Lal in Gimela Lele May Tandas. So even when I'm sleeping, I'd listen to him. I think Ulukulum Elugutung Tate. And he would say, Lord, please take me. Because second thing there's nothing that I'm living for. On earth. My wife is dead. Go to Nang Tati Limungai Kulum, because why not act? Because he always prayed to be able to speak in tongues. The first and second week passed. When he, he got hot, he got taken to the doctor and he came back. The doctor said there's nothing wrong. Then on June 16, at 16, the thing was a standard. And they got told to go and ask the sorcerer why is he so hot? Because now he doesn't want anything to do with sorcerers because he turned himself back to So my aunt So at the end at the end when we finish praying he speaks a language that I don't understand and I understand now that he was speaking in tongues he said Lord forgive all the people that have done me wrong because I forgive I thought he was coughing but in fact it was his spirit leaving him so the to tell him that he's now passed on. They'll say, Oh, before that, we're busy family meeting, but the following night, 
wabizi family meeting epsugu ngo 1 he called the family meeting at 1 am what he uma ngishona he said if i die nizele ngayilandela indlela yokukhonza abantu abaphansi la iphayi follow the way of ancestors ngoba namhlanje siyahlupheka ingenxa yale yanto because we are in mena ngoba bweni ungikuzame konke ngikwenze konke akungisebenzelani i tried everything and nothing worked for me nihlale kujesu just remain in jesus bavuma malume and they all agreed kwalalo kanti says uzoshona ngakusasa ngo6 episuku but he was going to pass away this next day ekhaya baba bebe sindi siyo aunty noma luma abanye all my aunties and uncles were saying kodwa umkhulu utheme shona kwawa laba basindisiwe kwayibona abasibuyisele kukhonza namadlozi but when he died it was those who were apparently said that went back to ancestors but hayi khole into ka Jesus they said Jesus doesn't work sebenze ngobufakazi bokuthi nathi simzamila kasisebenzelanga and they had that um, testimony that we tried Jesus but he didn't work for us so if family baba ya divided and then the family was divided ukuthi khona balandela izwi likababa uthe singayilandeli la yandlela some will follow my grandfather said God demands the food laba bathi bamzamile ujesus abamsebenzelana then others will say they tried Jesus and so waqala ke khaya baba babuka izinto zokuthi baba benikela kodwa still besihlupha kodwa be fast kodwa besihlupha ka yikho le into ka Jesus say grandfather was fasting and giving and he was still poor babuyela ke lehampilo ke baba so they went back to that life waqala futhi kwahlatsha kwayila sengiba khona exposed ke mina ngwabe sengimdala and that's where i became exposed because i grown up waqala ka experience ukubona umawami impilo ayiphila mina ngakazalwa ngase sengiyayibona sengikhulile and i started to see the life that she lived before i was born esiqale gula umkhule sakhona wayengaguli my grandfather was alive she was ngange ngimbone nje kwenzakala izinto kuya nomkhulu athandaze but i was young to understand ukuthi kwenzakalani before i was too young to understand what was happening when she get sick and my grandfather uqala lo ngoyi ube namandla ekhontrole noma eh umtshele ukuthi fanele agqoke nangaqoke in enze iphi he style angayenzi iphi he style ekhaya my grandfather was the one who had power to tell her what to do so bahlaba babe khaya but still impilo yafana ngikaze mena ngikubona ukuba ngcono yabo eh kuthe uma aqinisa ikhanda then mom became very stubborn ukuthi ngithathi mina lento that she's not taking mena ngahlala emzini womuntu ngathwasa if there is one thing ifanele ngiyenze ukuthi ngibuyele kule yampilo angiyenze yabo and she said that if there's one thing that so, i must do to go back i will ekhaya baba uma bamthatha njengane pillar so they perceive my mom as a pillar and i even perceived her as a pillar mom asukile nje impilo izokubhedela if you angered her your life would go bad so they felt so selfish ekhaya if you angered her your life would go bad so they felt so selfish ekhaya and they would feel that she was selfish ngoba bahlupheka ngoba yena kafuna ukuthatha ubungoma because they're suffering because she doesn't want to take on the ancestral spirit what he i singahlupheka before wethu kodwa u aunt usaphila ngengibithatha ubungoma aunt esaphila and she said that she refuses to take on that life while her aunt is still alive so kwa ukuthi nje nami baba nginalo manje o mysterious yabo ngizizo nje nami ngina amandla yokuthi i remember the other day sila ka besta eh u driver u tekisa mqasule i remember one day when the driver angered her uma atha sel and she says we must get off the taxi ya si taxi phuma nje la ka best robotini ya shayisa and even as the taxi turned the corner i got into it betha abantu ore kumene ntsha isisi une ntlizi ye mbisisi and they say sister you are cruel uma said ngifuna ukubona uzo fika api sehle taxi ni esho ku drive and she said to the to the driver i want to see how far you'll go with me so na mama bakakhula ngena lo manje ukuthi my mom is supernatural and i always had the thing that my mom is a supernatural person eh ayo kumlinga ye wenza it's just that ama emotions like they are so strong it's not that she was doing anything it's just that her emotions were yeah zwakala me happy no me deniwe you can feel when she's happy so fanele ngase so ngesikhathi semgcine ku happy side so we always had to keep her on the happy side me deniwe ukuthuka kuvele kufikele lidlo zela madoda because when she is angry they'll say that and they will see ukuthi i furniture some of the furniture is broken some you'll see that the furniture at home some of it is broken ayiphulwa ngayigebe ngumbe sediniwe isicabu yasithatha sibeke phansi when she's angry she can even break the door off its hinges ibuka ingene ngeyibhakela and she can punch the mirrors the bafis no one will ongakwazi ukumkhamlisha down mesifike kule level of dinu to the level of anger no one can calm her down so suke sekufanele uma lo mwami asuke from a respect so my uncle must come from merits but as she simple pekha ya shwelezi to come and burn incense in the house so yaqala baba lento ngangabe ngisa i enjoy before i would still enjoy ngoba ngayibona isingihlukumezela uma wami because i saw it tormenting my there was mom. other day i woke up khona ngenyawe suke khaya eyendwedwe she would walk Barefoot from home to Ndwetwe. When I heard her husband 
they went to go and fetch this cow. And because that man understood how these things were, he apologized. And he said, whenever my uncles wouldn't love her. But when it's okay. They'll say when you anger us, it's fine. But when we anger you, we have so, to pay. I'll see you're a human being. So you're not a person that we can so live with. Experience rejection. And then we started experiencing rejection. So so then when I grew up, I started having dreams. And I would tell my mom. And she'll say, because she didn't get me. Obviously, target. That means you're the target. And even you being born means that you were going to come after me or follow me. So because up until as an Afrika lay Mount Zion Baba. Then was one deliver when I came to Mount Zion you one sugar nis and ale moya separated me from these spirits. Got the Babenga Gushu could see what I can say. Egg Hamben go cola in the journey of faith. Big feeling humming humming is a good tea. I would go forward and feel like I was taking steps back. I would go forward and feel like I'm taking steps back. I'll have dreams. It's difficult to dream a cross with a demon. And then to say it's a demon. It, it wasn't possible for me. So in the love, got the interest you. Yeah, Mr. Be win and guy. The way that they would win my heart. Was for them to come to my dreams. And I would dream of people that I loved. And, and they would say things. And they'll say things in my dreams. And they'll happen for real in real life. So ngakina sengi si as intengs wa yenzukin. And I said, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to make this thing balance. I'm going to do this thing and I'm going to also hold it on the side. But then, and then you delivered me from that. And Jesus freed me from it. So the spirit of ancestry is very stubborn. Especially if there's still people in the family that believe in it. At the moment at home, I mean, I know my abanda basin deceive. At the moment at home, it's only my mom and I who are saved. She's also worshipping at Mount Zion. She's also worshipping at Mount Zion. We were figures cards last year. I got the same way. No, I miss I. There was a time last year. Same way, we found this. We were shy. Pants and going. Yeah, we were going to go and do some things. We were going to go. When I was a pastor, and I said that I would do the ceremony. And my mom was so confused. Do you see thank you? And my mom was so confused as to how. Because I was having and dreams. She gives me money and I told. And in my dream, she gives me money. So and in real life, I, I get owe money. her that. So I was certain that that meant that I had to do her ceremony. That time, Baba, my mom had to be strong for me. I had 13 that I didn't want to do it in secret. I wanted you to know that I'm going to do because this ceremony. Because everyone at home didn't want to do I it. I loved her so much. I would see, I love her so much that I'd see her in my dreams so as she was. And you would laugh at me like how you're laughing now. <laughs> What's it when? Na, guess yes. And you said you, and I said yes, me. I have nothing to lose. But but just when you're trying to dance, I see this. You go to the zoo, she's a lame boy, Zinjeli. I love Jesus. I'm still saved. It's just that I'm just gonna sit with this goat. Do you see how strong it is for you? Yeah, we're not in a mad lag. And she was very convinced. And why did you say? That's why I laughed at her. That's why. Okay, go back. Continue. Then, what else can she get, Bab? After you laughed at me, Dad. What's it? And then you asked me, what did my mom say? Ungasi mi nu mau meleni naku. Uma wevela pelelo amanda bab. Whenever mengi kala, 
Avelas and Jemina Ditegil, Mansumina Gissing Landela, no Colo, young Tita Minangas, Shona, Colo, and Sanguel, we move. Guess us, we are the same meal. And I would say, we're not going back, we're just standing here. Azuma, okay, what Glungil, Locos of Bona, she will cry sometimes, Abo. Sometimes she would cry. At Mdanam, Locos of Bona, go right. And she said, whatever you think is right. Do it because even when I tell her about these dreams, she'd also be tormented by them. I always dream of her sitting outside And she was so confused, she was like, did they even get chased out of heaven? I couldn't answer that, Bab. And I couldn't answer. When a person, when a one hill is on a goosey, you said a testimony, you go to my kill one born as a win. Manja sell young apparently, Ebo, Uma was a cool and cosine, Baba, wherever long understand. Gives him in a eight angas, Margotta, a dula, panga, pandy, looking quasi. All I know is that she's outside. Okay, let's share something, right? She was so broken hearted. Oh, why Limelega couldn't listen? She was very broken hearted. I had to ask Kuchesu. I had to ask Jesus to give us permission to take her to heaven to see where her aunt is. Then Jesus gave me that permission. And I said, I'll take her there. Because each and every time we are calling, 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 Because when they say the spirit of ancestry holds everything of yours, it holds your energy, your will, and your mind. When they say do this, you want to do it with your whole self. So I, I knew that if I take her that side to see, it'll help her to a certain extent. To a certain for her heart to be comforted. Then, and then she went and she saw. We didn't enter through the way where the dead enter. There's different ways you can enter. Then we entered. We enter through a door, not because a gate. when you are dead, you enter through the gate. Because when you are dead, you enter through the gate. Yes. Then when you get on that's where when we see Singene Zulini Singena Lap, right? That's where we enter. Because so was boy. So that we can come back out. That means a different thing. Okay, can you tell us which were born and briefly? Can you tell us briefly what you saw? I saw people that I didn't recognize. Go Tangal is cutting hamburg. But it's as if when I was going, my spirit knew where I was going. Up until I saw my aunt. She wasn't who she was on Cause earth. Because she died of a stroke. But she didn't have a stroke in heaven. She was beautiful. She was very happy. When she saw me, she got a fright. She could see that I wasn't meant to be there. Because the clothes that I was wearing were not the same then as the one I had. She asked me, what are you doing here? She's, I told her, I'm following her. What's he? Cool. And she said, I'm very happy. I won't follow you. And I asked her, even if I said, let's go home, and she said, no, I'm too happy. But alone gave me peace. Because it says, because when she died, she was sick in her bed. I made her say the Lord's Prayer and I then, went to Bible College. And then she passed away. She didn't know that she was a mother. 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 She was a mother
Then I learned that what she was being done so, to her, she was being with. So the God looks, who looks at the heart knew that her heart was with him. So the God knew that her heart was with him. So Baba, I think I told you to love and have peace. Ang pinda ng babang ng babang depression. Because I'd be so depressed and people wouldn't understand why. But then I would say if there's one thing I know, she's at home. But then Baba Gwasa when Zagala language she could be using very little and I started seeing her outside. And I was confused. I was confused as to what was happening. But that day, Baba Skulu Mele Ofesi. That day that we spoke in the office. He showed me that it's not her. And you showed me that it wasn't her. It is a familiar spirit. It was a familiar spirit masking itself as her. So then, I was like, I was like, and then I changed my stance and I said, I'm not doing the ceremony anymore. And then my mom was confused. We're not doing it anymore. And I didn't explain to her too much what it was. I felt that she was above her and she wouldn't understand it. And when I was about to get married, <laughs> Things just didn't happen, and he even started to doubt if he was the right woman. Money whenever Kanele Zekai. Whenever he would come home, he would lose money. He would have problems. Kono um um tandas zige kaya oi sayo nuya tandas ya bo. Ogu femel. No age kogu femel. Is it spiritist by the house? O antwa mi ukonza ebanlin la kilo um tandas zilo. There's a spiritist around my house. My mom can see that I'm depressed. The people I mean to come, they're not coming. Then my mom can see that I'm depressed. My mom can see that I'm depressed. And she saw the cycle that that happened to her and her sister. And she saw the cycle that that happened to her and her sister. And she saw the cycle that that happened to her and her sister. And she saw the cycle that that happened to her and her sister. Quit divorce, quit again. Because even if they would get married, they would end up divorced. So she saw my mom that I'm is on us. I'm going to now. She says that. And my mom was saying, my sons are before me. So whenever these things would happen, my mom would blame myself. And she would say, maybe I should just go into the sorcery. Then, Lord, Baba, Lord, Auntie, 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 Lord, Baba, and then I said yes. Make busy with it. Uzo kwenye ngobo lil aige. Shona nkuona sisi mbele kwa sisi si wenza wong. And then I said if it means that I must end up being married, that's okay. I will do all of those things. I didn't know about that desperation ya ivugabi. And I didn't know where I got that desperation from. Nje, ngabona ngazi nje angazi ba bumbla ba ba mu biyao. And it felt like my world was crumbling. Then numa kuvelo kstake saiti nilega malumba matumalo menje merang na imalimbo zingi ngopele. My uncle would say, "I don't have the money for a then coat." Then my mom would say, "When you ask me, I'm seven and ten, silly, obviously, I'm busy getting things." My mom would say, "I don't have a proper job, so I can't afford a coat." Was that color for that? That's where we got stuck. Then again, because. I was learning in Angaba. Encourage you to always update your man of God in the days that are lying below. I would always encourage you to update the man of God in your life. What's so, happening? So, over time, I'm just like I'm linking again. I told them. I'm going to go to the temple. 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 I'm going so then I thought that really must be that you have prayed for me. You have anointed me with oil. But it's not like I'm coming to you with oil. But it's not like I'm coming to you with oil. This door of mine doesn't open, so I really need to go do these ceremonies. Whenever we are saying come be seated, we go to Axi Konanjal. Why are they at the thingy? We, I'm sure they will come back and call and call. Imaglog. You would say your wedding, your your marriage comes from God. So, oh, oh, that's how you say for you to do. Malogu, say, go be saying as you shout, then go back and go so and the limbeleg. God, the own to the limbeleg, on guy in the galang. It's just that, me say for the last thirty, God tell you a pambil. I'll send the gift. God tell you a pambil. Now, in Pella, Baba, we prayed. Anga zeng zeng the limbeleg, Baba zeng zeng the lute kaya. Just one day, unkulunkulunje, wal kashuli joga, wavelwati. 
month ending so lobo lagin eso in in a span of two weeks. Ya kumbuluguti sa sambi lo basambi so lomzo lani sa simhambi se eyo lande umutunge sar. Meng fige kai atuma abantu baga tube balet singwa tibati ba funuk zolo bo na ezin next week. When I come home, they, the the tube is brought a letter saying they want to come and pay dowry next week. Hanganga kola ba bugu se kuzogenze. And I couldn't believe that it would happen. But se kuzogenze ga ba 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 lobo la ba kai tafuns. And they paid the lobo la. La ga te siti kona ngere kuzogenze ga because even on his side, he even. He came to church safe. So he'll be so frustrated as I do. I'm just finding when you're doing this and those are me. So we're both confused on either of us. But I'm confused on either of us. But I'm confused on either of us. But I'm confused on either of us. Without going back. But what I can testify is that Jesus didn't cross the mark. As going back to praise other gods. So... After he'd finished paying the lobola, because whenever final loot sent the lender no seek, it's like a was we tinder, unga we tinder ngu moya wa majo. To do something traditional, you can't touch it without. So final loot sent the galo members so zonge lezo zin. Because now we need to do. I felt myself gusi ginge na shona pants, shona pants. I could feel myself going down. But he, up until the babas ang kazel. Up until you explain to me, ukusi. Oh, it's not you are worshiping the ancestors. Just look at it as the exchange of a gift between the families. It's not a, in the ceremony of worshiping the ancestors, but an exchanging of gifts between families. Nala pofuti baba uche swabwe nzumtumbo ami wa is success. The very same aunties babe tinge guze wenze ge menge nzulange mbagega. The very same people were saying I had to do certain ceremonies to get married were the ones who were the most joyful at my ceremony. So, I can see that my husband is seeing the power of Jesus. We we had them fights. After that, we would argue. We would even laugh after we have forgiven each other, wondering what we were fighting about. Baba, serious, like, who's our father? We would say, "Let me for an example, get to the shirt, see, the khaki, at the brown." I would say, "The shirt is khaki," and you would say, "No, it's brown." Me saying, "Get me no phone, no go on parts." I said, "No, you phone no go on parts."